Hi everybody, it's Mark Schelsch here. This is the Mark Art Show coming to you from Galleria de las Islas in Metro Manila, Philippines. I want to talk today a little bit about discouragement. Now we might even make this go longer, we'll see. But I want to talk about how easy it is to become discouraged through what we say. Very often we tell people that we shouldn't tell we tell them our dreams and our plans and our schemes. Now, not all family and friends are going to have the same forward vision and dreams and enthusiasm and excitement for what you're doing. Your goals should be big, you know that. But you've got to be careful who you share those with because a lot of people want to pull other people down. A lot of people aren't enthusiastic about other people achieving big things because that's threatening. So, remember what they used to say in World War II. Simply this, loose lips sink ships. Be careful who you talk to about your dreams and goals and visions because your own loose lips could sink your ship of dreams. Now what do I mean? Well we all know people out there and we know very well we should never share positive future thinking things with them. Why not? Because they're negative and they are easily threatened when we talk, start to talk about big dreams and big things. Beware of the person. You've seen the, the, the look on people's face when you've been sharing your dreams and what you're going to do and what you want to accomplish and they sit there with that look, you know, that hmm, hmm look. And then they want to take you aside and for your own good, Mark, I want to give you some advice. I've heard that before and I'm sure you've heard it. And that good advice is usually good, safe advice, but it's certainly not the advice you need. It's the advice that says, you know, Calm down, settle down, things need to just progress slowly, you, you will work through it slowly and work it out. Really the wrong advice totally, because that's the advice of keep safe, be safe, be average, be like me, don't take risks. That's what it's saying. But you're, if you're a visionary and you've got dreams, you're a risk taker. You've got to take some risks. Life is risky. None of us get out of this alive. So you've got to be prepared to, to go forward and do things differently. So be careful who you disclose your dreams and visions to because they will try and give you good advice and calm you down and get, you know, settle down. You know, we, we'll work this through. Well, the truth is that what happens then is that the thief comes along and says, see, I told you, I told you this is wrong. Do you need to be safe? You need to be average. Don't do this. This is wrong. People will laugh at you. People will criticize you. You see, good advice here is the advice you should be listening to. And it's not the advice you should be listening to. The advice you should be listening to is go out there and make a trail. Go out there and make a difference. Go out there and change your world. That's the advice that we need. Because you see, people are afraid of others who want to go out there and change the world. They truly are. People don't want that. The average person does not want change and does not want to be unsettled from where they are. But unsettling is the best thing that can happen. People envy those with vision, so when we envy something, we try and stop it. That's what happens. So, the first best decision you can make is keep your mouth closed around people you know will not encourage and push you with your dreams and schemes. Keep your eyes open and your ears open, but keep your mouth closed closed. Be careful who you share your dreams and visions with. Try and get, if you can, people around you who are motivated like you're motivated, who have the same kind of dreams that you have, 
They're the ones to talk about. The people who will say, hey, I'll keep you accountable. I'll make sure you do that. They're the people you want. The people who say to you, well, okay, let's do this. Let's make this happen. They're the people you want to be around. You want to be around people who are pushing, not pulling you back. Because if they pull you back, eventually you will stop and become stagnated and not move forward. Be careful of good advice. As good as it is, and it may be good advice, the way the average person sees it, but you ask yourself, is this going to stop me from accomplishing what I want? And you know very well if it is that, straight away the thief will come along and say, this is dangerous, don't do this, stop, stop, I want to be safe, I want you to be safe, there could be lions and tigers out there, you will be in trouble. When you know the thief comes along and says that, that's when you say, this good advice is not my advice. My advice is to go forward because when the thief turns up, I must be doing the right thing. Okay? Only share your vision and dreams with those who are like-minded, who feel like you feel. And look, they don't have to be artists. They can be anybody. They can be poets. They can be writers. They can be designers. They can be the young lady who's, who's designing dresses and everybody says, she's crazy, don't do this, get a normal job. No, I say do it and push the boundaries. The person who wants to write the great novel, do it. The person who wants to publish their poetry, do it. You can. The internet's here. We can do everything we want to do and accomplish our dreams. Don't let negativity stop. Stop you, my friends. Push through it. Remember, good advice can derail your train. And I tell you what, the thief will make sure it does if you listen to good advice. How many people that are listening to me now have taken good advice at some stage in their life and have regretted it afterwards and said, I should have done what I wanted to do. I should have followed that dream. Well, my friends, it's not too late. Get up today. You can change your life. You can change your dreams. If you're an artist and you've been held back by worrying about what other people think or what other people will say, they will always think that. They'll always say that. Forget about them and move forward and accomplish the things you want to accomplish. That's what we've got to do. Overcome good advice and run with your dreams. Build and build and build and be the person, be the artist that you want to be. That's what we are looking for. Okay, my friends, I hope that helps a little bit. Remember, keep your mouth closed, keep your eyes open and your ears open and be careful who you share your dreams with because there's some people out there who want to sink your ship. And that's true. Okay, and sometimes they're the closest people to us. I don't say be nasty to them. I don't say reject them. I don't say get rid of them. I just say don't listen to good advice because sometimes it's the worst advice you can get. Dreamers dream big. Visionaries see a long way. And the best way to prove your dreams and schemes are right is not to talk about it. Do it. That's what makes the difference. Action action, action. They say you can't, prove you can. They say you shouldn't, go out and do it. They say you should be safe, go out, it's dangerous. Get outside there, be dangerous. Get out on the risky, climb that mountain, climb that cliff, climb that sheer straight ledge, get to the top and show you can do it. Okay friends, you have a great day. It's Monday here in Manila and I'm going to get in and get some work done. I look forward to the day when you come and visit me here in Metro Manila and come and enjoy this beautiful country. It's summertime here. Uh, well, it's always summertime here. Um, and come and enjoy this place. Remember to reach out and touch people, care for people. Hugs and smiles are free. Enjoy life and live your dreams and fulfill, fulfill, fulfill all the things and the promise that you've made to yourself. Don't let other do-gooders stop you from being you. Have a great day. I'm going to talk to you tomorrow. Ciao.